Now let us move on to the fourth question. Shade 1 by 2 of the circles in box A, 2 by 3 of the triangles in box B and 3 by 5 of the squares in box C. So let us first find out 1 by 2 of the circles in box A. So 1 by 2 of circles in box A. This implies 1 by 2 times the total number of circles in box A. That is there are 12 circles in box A. Therefore 1 by 2 times 12. So 2 goes in 12 6 times. Therefore half of the circles in box A mean 6 circles. Therefore we need to shade 6 circles out of box A. So now let us find 2 by 3 of the triangles in box B. So 2 by 3 times the total number of triangles in box B. The total number of triangles in box B are 9. Therefore we have 2 by 3 times 9. 3 goes in 9 3 times. So 2 times 3 is 6. Therefore the total number of uh, triangles to be shaded in box B. So now let us consider the third bit. 3 by 5 of the squares in box C. So 3 by 5 of the squares in box C. This implies 3 by 5 of the total number of squares in box C. So in box C there are 15 squares. Therefore 3 by 5 times 15. 5 goes in 15 3 times. So 3 times 3 is equal to 9. Therefore number of squares to be shaded in box C is 9.